Hi. Hi. How are you? Yeah, I'm, I'm terrific. And I'm terrific because after our Amoon Pockverb video, mm. by the way, we've had a few comments uh, from people who didn't want us to, uh, who were shitty that we didn't uh, show all of the, the reverb and the delays oh, okay. together. So many combinations that with with that little pedal. Well, there's 49 combinations. There's seven reverbs, seven delays, and the video was already 20 minutes long. We showed you them all separately. Surely you know how they sound. You can work it out in your head. And how much was that one again? Oh, 80, 80 bucks or something. Yeah, it was, it was cheap as shit. 78 bucks, I yeah. think, is what Patty paid for it. So you might as well just buy one and experiment yourself. Yeah, and it's a great pedal. So. And then you did what? I bought this. <laughs> So this has got a drive, a distortion, a delay. It's got an effects loop. It's got a cab simmed headphone output. 85 bucks. Yeah. But it's also got a tuner. Oh yeah, tuner in it as well. And, and tap tempo. And te tempo for the delay, <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's made out of metal. The switches are soft. Um, they're not clicky, they're soft switches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the only thing is when I pulled it out of the box, when it arrived from China, this plastic cover thing covering the screen there, uh, was stuck over the letter D of the dist portion there, uh, which I just peeled it off and stuck it back on where it was supposed to be, and it's been fine ever since. It hasn't moved. And for 85 bucks, I don't care. <laughs> um, I haven't played with it. Rod's had a quick play with it just then. Just now. Uh, let's get into it. Yeah, let's see how it sounds. Clean sound. What would you like to start with? Let's go from right to left. Let's do with the drive. Do it. All right. It's all right. It's a tube screamer. It's very tube screamer, <laughs> yeah. isn't it? Yeah, mid mid range. It's great. Uh, there's a hot mode. I'll turn the hot mode on. Okay. So a lot more gain. It's a lot louder too. Yeah. There's a lot more volume and a lot more gain. Yeah. Heaps. Uh, okay, I'm going to... I'm just going to play some knobs really quick and you keep playing. I'll just play. All right. It's a perfectly serviceable overdrive. Cool, and that was just the drive section? That's just the drive section, yeah. Uh, I'll flick it back over to the, the lower gain setting okay, now. Okay, cool. I like that a bit better. All right. Um, Next. The distortion. Let's go. Oh. It's a bit hairier, isn't it? Nice. It's a bit grittier. Um, it's it's meaty. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It sounds great. Keep playing. I'm going to hit the switch. Yeah. I just want to see if I can stack the overdrive into the You read my mind. Distortion. <laughs> you read my mind. Yes. Wow. Okay.
Oh, it's noisy. And you can hear the sea. <laughs> it's noisy. You can it? hear the ocean. But you'd expect that kind of noise with all that gain. Well, and I've got it on the high gain setting on the drive. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's when I hit that switch on the distortion, it sounded like it scooped the mids out a bit for more sort of modern yeah. modern metal. Yeah. 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 All right, so next we've got the delay. Yeah. There's three modes, tape, tape, oh, I can't remember. Tape, echo, and analog. Tape, echo, and analog, which are, I mean, analog and echo are sort of the same thing anyway. Mm -hmm. But uh, it's on the tape setting right now. Just give us a click and let us have a listen. Oh, I'll turn it on. Engage. <laughs> Just give us a click. Yeah. And again. Wow, so, so that first one already has like a really degraded... Yeah, real degradation. Top end and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. all right. Yeah. All right, I'll flick it up one. We'll have a look. Yeah. This is the echo. So this one's, the, the first one, the tape one lost its top end really quick. This one's losing its bottom end yeah, really quick. Yeah, yeah, it is, isn't it? It's, it's almost like a lo-fi delay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's all right though, isn't it? Sorry for some spacey stuff. It's it's terrific. It's a. I mean, there's companies deliberately making lo-fi delays and lo-fi reverbs at the moment, <laughs> and they've sort of like I don't know if it's deliberate or not, but they've accidentally stumbled across a pretty lo-fi delay. It's yeah, pretty granular and cool. It is. All right, analog. This is the analog setting. Once again, that's losing its top end. Okay, it's, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's keeping all of its base though. Yeah. It's a very usable overdrive. It's a very usable distortion. There's three great sounding delays mm. in there. Tap tempo, mm. plus there's an effects loop if you wanted to put a chorus pedal or a reverb pedal or something in there as well. It's got a tuner and a cab simmed headphone yeah, output so you can practice. Well. Yeah. If you just had this sitting in your bag for 85 bucks, that's 85 Australian bucks, mm. so 50 in the US. I mean, why wouldn't you just have one of those sitting in your bag? So you could take that, that headphone out into the PA if you wanted to. You, in theory, you could yeah. use the drive or the distortion as your preamp and then use the cab simmed headphone output to yeah. go direct to the PA. I've yeah. got no way to test that out here to show everybody, but... Wow. I'm assuming it would be a pretty stock IR, maybe like a 112 or something. There's nothing in the manual that says what it is. Sweet. So... Uh, that's it. And a tuner. Sweet. Can I just dial something up for a second? Yeah, sure. Go ahead.
Yeah, you could dial in some doom with that. Yeah. <laughs> Just amuse yourself no end. Yeah, it's it, it's oh, 85 bucks. Yeah. And it, you can run it off a single... Like, it only pulls like 300 milliamps or something like that. Oh, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I guess you could even run it off like one of those little battery pack ones with the little... Could. Yeah. Done. If you needed to get out of trouble, quick, pack one in your in your guitar case. And seriously, if you had that that, that A moon pock verb in the effects loop of this A moon, what is it? Pock Pokemon. Pokemon. <laughs> Not Pokemon. 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 Yeah. I mean, you got a full versatile rig. Yeah. For a hundred and sixty bucks. There's stuff out there, people. Get onto it. Have a look. Thanks, A moon. <laughs> Thanks, people. Bye. Bye.